uh, proceedings at the TRRC. Uh, Imam, you have the floor. If you can offer some prayers, please. Imam C. أعوذ بالله من السيدان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين الرحمن الرحيم مالك يوم الدين إياك نعبد وإياك نستعين إذن أسرار المستقيم أسرار الذين أنمت عليهم غير المعدوب عليهم ولا الضالين وإن تستفتفوا فقد جاءكم الفتح نصر من الله وفتح قريب نبصر المؤمنين بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل الله أحد الله السمد لم يلد ولم يولد ولم يكن له كفانا بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الفلق من شر ما خلق ومن شر الشق إجا وقبا ومن شر النفاسات في الأرض ومن شر حاسد إجا حسد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم قل أعوذ برب الناس ملك الناس إله الناس من شر وسوس الخناز الذي يوسوس في صدور الناس من الجنة والناس إن الله وملائكته يصلون على النبي والذين آمنوا صلوا عليه وسلم تسليم صلى الله تعالى عليه وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم وتسليما سبحان ربك رب العزه عما يصفون وسلام على المرسلين والحمد لله رب العالمين. امين شكرا امام سي بشوف يو هاف ذا فلو بليز. ثانك يو تشيرمان. لورد جود المايتي. كريتو اوف هيفن اند ارت. اند يو هو كريت اول هيومان كايند ثرو اوت ذا هول يونيفرس. ان يور ايمج اند ان يور لايكنس. We continue to call upon your throne of grace, of mercy, of compassion, of love, and of forgiveness. That Lord, you look kind upon the human race. Look upon our, have mercy upon our human frailty, our sinfulness, and our wickedness. The things that we do to one another, which are shameful. We ask, Lord, that at this time the wind of change will blow heavily throughout the whole wide world and that the love and the fear of God will saturate in the hearts and minds of all human beings so that the love of God will be uh, the attitude, will be the order, will be the action of the dealings of mankind to humankind. And as we continue our sittings here, Lord, we continue to ask that you grant those witnesses that will be coming forward the boldness to be able to speak the truth and grant the commission also the discerning spirit to discern between truth and falsehood. We continue to ask that you keep the populace also in perpetual patience so they will with patience allow the due process of the law to take its course. And you, the judge of all mankind, will bring justice to the satisfaction of all. This we ask through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much indeed, Amen Bishop Odeko. Uh, Council, if we are ready to proceed with the uh, witness, um, please uh, go ahead. Uh, good morning, Mr. Chairman. Good morning, commissioners and members of the audience. May I ask that the witness be ushered in, please, and we are ready to proceed. Thank you. Uh, welcome, uh, Mr. Kohli. You may be seated, please. Uh, the interpretation services, are you guys ready? Um, thank you very much. Uh, Mr. Kohli, welcome back to the TRRC. Thank you. Mr. Kohli, the TRRC. And uh, may I remind you that you are still on the oath? Yes. Um, may I ask uh, before we start, do, are you clearly understanding the female interpreter? Eh. Yes, I am understanding her. Are you having any difficulty 
understanding any aspects of her interpretation. If I do not understand, I usually ask her to repeat. Um, thank you very much. Um, the reason why I am asking these questions is to ensure that you know exactly what is going on. You know exactly the questions asked mm -hmm. so that you may be better able to give your testimony. My welcoming Monday King Pro, I'm a man to man be our own one on an own guy King Dir, come for the money for the set, the young for Prumbum and Mujabi, Prumbuka, Prokabumol and Bujo Jack. Yes, um, uh, Mr. Coley, uh, let me remind you once again that it is a criminal offense to lie before this commission and it is also a criminal offense to lie on the oath in this country. Yes, Yes, I know that. Let us proceed. Uh, uh, yesterday before we left we were talking about uh, the beatings of prisoners that occurred right behind your office. At the headquarters of the Gambia Prison Service. Headquarters at the Gambia Prison Service. Uh, could you tell us about that incident? What happened? That was what I've said yesterday. I said that. I had that prisoners were brought to that place. But in the in the office name. But I was in my office attending other visitors. Attending to some other visitors. So I was busy on I was administration. Busy. I was busy on administrative matters. So uh, I know I can confirm they came there, but I could not tell. I had them shouting. Officers and prisoners. Both officers and prisoners. But you only concentrated But I was still concentrating on my work. With the visitor that came visiting. Um, and after that, what happened? You were, co you were concentrating on your work um, with that visitor that came. Um, and proceed, please, and tell us what happened for the rest of that date. Yeah. That day. <laughs> After some time, I do not hear anything from them, and they return to the main yard with the prisoners. <coughs> with the prisoners. That's it. Yeah, no cap, no cap, John. No talk, Emmanuel. That is what I know. Or is it? This is the lie I want to tell the commission. No, no, man. Tell. We're free. Free from no man. Yeah, from no man. We're free from the left. Fadif. But you're free from 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 where? From no man. Be erect commission. Man, come on, Regina. Kukula and Baku did me. You're free in the mile two. Like I said, they were returned to the main yard in mile two. But this is not what you know. Is the lie you want to feed the commission? No, no. We can't go over the job. We cannot have a kill of it. We can't come for him. We cannot make him be a wreck. A a a a wreck. The commission. You don't have a wreck. Why should I lie? 
What I know is what I am saying here. All right. Okay. Thank you very much. Uh, let's dissect what you have said. You said I heard that prisoners were brought to that place. That's what you said, isn't it? Yes. Yes. Uh, and can you confirm again? You yeah. just told the commission a minute ago that I heard that prisoners were brought to that place. Nyana no seten han bejat mandiko au none commissioni nu genjam mandiko boko prisoner ko ngal linga beto di place tang tang tanu manji won ko toko. Yes. Yes, I said so. But isn't that a lie? Ana ro kan to furi kagajo. Fukajo bo bonde ro ta be na ko jiir le mbebo mi genya eh eh kanyosoro ko dam prisoner di ko officer how could that be a lie i said it here that when they brought them there i had some arguments okay. two between the prisoners mi, and mi, the mi, officers easy easy just answer the questions you don't have to open it too much by getting into issues you are not asked just answer the question nane ko mu yente rek wona mo ne ak keñ mu jabi wo tax mu jaw mu nem ko sanke na ho du sanke man te kurin bi ke ba nak keñuti aw sanke tan reem rek na mu jabi to mu reto you did not just hear that the prisoners were there you organized for the prisoners to be brought to that place isn't that correct ane o ay seni matiko aw jamu to kebata ko prisoner ko ngalinga betode bare aw man kam meno aw seni furima man ko muru ko prisoner beto min jimol ko ngol ko kawan ko ran ko kar sa asene fo eh ora ora ci ni ora ci la who gave that order it wasn't me okay uh, may i ask that uh, the testimony of ijame uh, ibu jame be be played please and you would hear that you ordered that those prisoners who were alleged to have been involved in the mobile phone saga be brought to the headquarters and nya jinta na video yati ibrahima jame na sen messi de wa dire nane ona rex nane aw sen frimaf mu ko muru ko prisina kala ko kan mani me ko ko wege rek ko sofisa ko wete mobile mu ko ngali be babu officer wali headquarters yoli pour mu ko ngolen ko kis kis ko wete mobile eh uh, obivan could you kindly uh, play that video please I can see one of the legal officers uh, going inside the OV van to have that uh, evidence plate. Okay, I, I guess that is it. Mile two, please. Yes. Ha. Now, two three. Mile two, Now, tell us about who you tortured. Say, a funny thing. It is the man who tortured Jumani and Lela Liparo. Okay, this was one fateful uh, Thursday. You get arms or no more thing. Whilst we are on parade, what on the number loading the parade la? The director general was addressing the parade. Director, no continue the loading of the diam ka moli. The then operation uh, officer Ibrahim Asisi. Ibrahim Asisi, member no je member marado gola no. The chief officer Kalilu Shane and uh, Lamin Jabang. Chief Officer Nyin Kalilu Sane and Lamin Jabang came with a complaint to the parade ground. In other words, the parade came and damaged the Nyin Kolea Kolea and the Nyin Kolea Kolea Kolea. That they uh, caught a mobile phone and some drugs. Kwee mobile phone and some drugs. And some prisoners. And some prisoners. And they are talking about the Nyin Kolea. When they told that to DG. Bring you over Nyin Kolea. While on parade, what are men on the parade la? Did you then now instructed them? Yeah, to did you now now come with them to bring them to headquarters and take their statements? Puri sinati. Them take their statements. Puri sinati. Korda bani into kasurongo la korda bani into puri yeni ninka ninja ninka rol ninja bro se kunu itema. He then instructed the former deputy director Yaya Jaju. Yeah, to now now come with the anolango la korda tio anolango la Yaya Jaju. Who uh, joined them in assisting them to? I come from my side as he makoi. 
that they can go into the bottom of the tree to know how the mobile and the drugs you came into the place. Yes, there is a coin in the land of the mobile or the money. See, I'm asking you, you know, coin is or not? Enough. You instructed for those prisoners to be brought to the headquarters. No, no, I'll find you, David. I'll send you free map. Is it not? The prisoners be brought to headquarters only. Isn't that the truth? And yes. 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 And just a minute ago, you told us you only heard they were there, but you did not know anything about it. But a minute ago, we didn't know. We were not even there in the morning. I know a car was a car was only jammed. The car was not locked. The car was not policed. But I know we were not told we could not liberate or send to free. We could not liberate. Why are you lying to the commission? No, no. I only have one here. And you are coming from where? It's a different date. No, no. This was a different date. Okay, tell us about the different dates. The day I was informed about the discovery of the mobile phone, I asked them to take them to the hall. investigate. For them to conduct an investigation and those responsible to be charged. And then? Yeah. And the second one? The following day, the following day, headquarters again. They were brought to the headquarters again. And what happened on the second day? That was the day I was referring to that I had them arguing. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Mr. Kohli, yes. 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 And, and you have to be very careful. You ordered that these prisoners be brought into the headquarters. That is the truth, isn't it? Yes, I have said it here that I was the one that gave the order. Exactly. And they were taken right behind your office no. correct like i said i had the prisoners and the officers arguing behind my office just answer the question yes they were brought behind your office yes 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 you instructed uh, the recruits to join the officers behind your office. Ban au useni furu na officer kuli kasi kuna ku 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 na bde ku officer kuli ka kama kaka kelo ku mungu tek ku prisonak. Ya si na officers ni 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 asaini di buroko. I only assign the senior officers. Ni ako kuingia ya ora members of the officers. So where the senior officers invite or the members of the prisons, I would not be able to know. But this is not true in this particular instance. You know that is not true in this particular instance. Like I said, I only assigned the senior officers. So if they would invite other junior officers, I wouldn't be able to know. Because in young officer, okay. Since I was still in my office. Okay. Uh, 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 you see, uh, David, um, this was a whole operation that you guys conducted correct it was a whole operation of search and arrest of the inmates correct yes i gave those instructions from nia because i was called from the nia that is fine mm -hmm. All right. And you did not only instruct the senior officers, right? And but I was sent to free my phone officer came there. Konyako boko kana mako kuboka the investigation. Then how would they have joined the investigations if I do not order them?
to do so. Okay, uh, let's look in your statement. Um, in the first statement, you indicated that I ordered the recruits to do the searches. Is that true? Yes. Yes, I did that. And it is still this search party that conducted the investigations, correct? When I gave the instructions for them to conduct the search, Jame uh, was the training school commander. Jame was the training school commander. Jame. Jame. I instructed him to go with some recruits to go and conduct a search. Because uh, uh, they are neutral. Because they were neutral. Because I know them. We understand that. Let me go ahead. No, you have just answered the question. It's ah, okay. not necessary for you to go okay. ahead. Okay, okay. Let's okay. exercise discipline, answer the questions, and then let's move on. And it is that group that actually conducted the search. It, Ibrahim Jame and his recruits. From the Yes, he was the one that led the instruct uh, the, the, the search because he was the training school commander. You could have simply answered yes and we move on. You don't have to continuously reminding us remind us that he was this, yes. he was that, he was that. Just answer yes. Or yes. Yes, and it is this group that arrested the prisoners and, and brought them to headquarters, correct? Yes. yes, and this group comprised Ibrahim Jami and the recruits. Yes. 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 And this is the same group that came behind your office with the prisoners. closed door. I could not tell because I was in closed doors. But I can tell that the officers with some prisoners came there. Uh, but it is also not true that you did not know what was going on. It is the truth because they had never returned to me and informed me as to what they had with the prisoners. But that also is not true. It's true to me. Uh, you are giving a false story because you want to save yourself from responsibility. My role was to conduct the search as the instructions came from the NIA that I should conduct a search and that's what I did. Uh, no, you ordered that these people be tortured to confess and to produce the mobile phones that were those were your instructions. Yes. 
When they were conducting the search in the cells, they did not beat any prisoner. Uh, yes, but they beat them right behind your office, three meters away from your office. <laughs> I have been saying that here, that my office is not open. Could you face the commissioners when you speak? No, but I'm not. I'm not. You are facing to me, then I'm talking yes, to you too. Face the commissioners. Okay. 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 To the commissioner. interpreters, yes. Face the commissioners. Okay. These people were are beating three meters away from your office. Right. Yes, could you immediately make the office in behind my office? Could you interpret his answer? Yes, they brought them behind my office. And uh, they were stationed three meters away from your office. But I could take him, digante eight or six meters, and see Fiji, the office early. The man in Kokuru, we are already there in office premises. I knew they were on the office premises. Uh, the, what I have just said is that they were brought behind your office, correct? I have said that here. Uh, and you were aware that they were behind your office when all this thing was going on? If they are behind me, what do I do? I wasn't the one, I wasn't the one that brought you Just there. answer the question. Yes, were you behind your office, Nani. yes or no? Nani. 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 Yes. I have okay. said it here. That okay. yes, but spare there. us the other rambling Nani. Nani. and just answer the Nani. Nani. question. Nani. 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 Otherwise, we will never finish. Nani. Yes? And uh, behind your office, where they were, it was just three meters away Nani. from the building that you occupied. Nani. I have not measured and cannot tell, but I know they were there. Uh, exactly. And you could hear them talk. Like I said here, I had the noise when an argument ensued between them. And uh, you could hear them talk to each other? That is what I have said. That I had them talk between themselves. They were arguing. Uh, so, and you were aware that your officers were there together with the prisoners you wanted investigated. Yes. Yes. And you had agitated conversations, real arguments, huh? loud arguments. Correct. The arguments that they had between them, I cannot tell, but then I had them south. That I, I can verily say. Uh, and if any one of them was crying, you would have had the person also. Yes, I said that I would hear and on this particular occasion, did you hear people crying and shouting? Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. 
That is what I've said. That I've had them. And they were beaten. Ban etaki kula kwe? Yakanya kuna gina moye mani bani njia fufuka of. If they were beaten, I don't know, but I heard them shout. But you just said you heard them crying. But I found more. I found more getan. No, ni njia njia kula kumbu kula. But yen mara ni ni njia njia fufuka of. But yam enaga kula kumbu enaga ni fufuka of ni jame. That is what I've said. I heard them shout, but I don't know he had them beating them. No, you said several things. You said you heard them shout. You heard them cry. That's what you said. Yes, that was what I said. So now you are telling us that uh, they were not beaten. Whether they were beaten or not, but I can verily say that I heard them shout. And you heard them cry. I also heard them. So you think grown adults would just sit there and start crying just out of nothing? For no reason at all. They manage all this fairly. And if an arm is not broken, man, it's broken. It's not broken. It's 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 Oh, ane jamé di alakom alakom area kila. Oh, awan nama je? Jamé that was at that area should be the person that would know. Yes, jamé has explained what has happened. Ane jamé onar rek wakam. Ara uru be enagede. Just what jamé has not seen. Yendi onar rek apare orde. Okay, and is that the reason why you also are saying that they are not beaten? Ah, mokam me apo mumbo rek gotekuti. Pasi ye yugut. Because I didn't see. But what I saw and what I heard is what I am saying. Yes, but you heard them cry. Why would people cry? Why would grown adults like them be crying? These are your prisoners. You have ordered that they be brought for an investigation. You hearing them cry behind your office. Did you care to find out why they were crying? Ani ma yeno buko di mara yoli kum don kuni fan au niwa usi ni furba mna kuna lima kujio ku ku kis kisi kuiste kuete mobile na kumi kuiste kuli au mjam si kawa soli mjam mko kuku bulok wakane au ubuni wana buko kani ndi ni wako wakane kumi bulok wakane njoo tu live ente mama ni wakane kumi bulok wani ra ibe njema ya ajabu ni di office like I said I had a visitor. In my office. I know if they are ready with whatever they are doing, they will come and report. Uh, as if he knew that whenever they were finished with the beating, they will come and report to you. That is what they should have done. So obviously, you knew what they did with the prisoners. I know what all Udo said. But you go out, no man, you go and call me a cane. They beat them to confession. Taking it, you go more and go sank him. And you were sitting in your office hearing everything. When out, no one like the officer, you only Monday jam. Like, 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 Ano son tu yombe ya ebuwa bulenge bati ofisiali. Wamu na begi ni? Inge inge mu konsider da jabu mumbo. Like I said, I was concerned. On my question and report, na boss nuka kwa sachi madi manu juke madi manu kani. So if the investigating team are ready, they should come back and report to me and say this is what we did. And Ija me did come back to you to report. And but Ija me pop na pipi. But we are not concerned about that. You think. You believe that the beating is lawful, isn't it? According to the act. And only body if I just let I just me ling le body. Only you only let back some care to. I want now man you me because can you make ya? Matiko eteke. You know essence. Matiko ano faku take on the kitten a sanke. Beating is lawful according to the act. Only I will remind you only. Yes. Copper police me you know essence. Me you are you are going to take ano. So for you as a prison administrator. 
it's certain circumstances you can beat your prisoners. Nani, kom amu nuka mani fano au rungu mduri ofisi, au gejar pumbi nike wafake yuare warangi tek, mbi yimo lengi ba juu njing mami. Yes. Allah dijat. Ubang nuba nuba evidence. If the prisoner refused and we have evidence against the individual, confess. He must confess. But this is the issue. He must confess. And you beat them to confess. Why are you beating them? And you beat them to confess. Why are you beating them to confess? That's the procedure, isn't it? You can't be broke up, but you must not be broken. No, normally, we can't be in fighting. We look at the officer, the prisoner. No, we are not going to insist on that. Where there is an infighting between officers and prisoners, and we have evidence against them, and evidence is that. And if you believe the prisoner who is about to destroy the evidence, oh, when they are within their mates in the Guinea, they would not talk. So you will have to bring them outside. You are listening? Thank you. Na no continue lomba intene. Okay. Kubinya be e e te di pangu chini au mama le sofisi wa nyia au be kaje for what? So if they bring them out, they will now ask you were caught with a mobile phone. Why do you attempt to destroy the evidence? So you a struggle chila you you more a problem eh? So that struggle would be the resulting problem to what had happened. And the struggle would be the beating. Yeah. So that they must confess. I'm just using your words. Already, the surface of the article, the person only. The issue of confession would be already they were caught with the article. It's just provoke a destruction. Where we said no was the destruction of the evidence. In this particular instance. What I clear. Yes. Uh, was any officer beaten? Could you take officer? A officer, but could take an officer? What do you want to mind? Be correct to me. I cannot tell because I was not told. The operation you correct to me, correct to me. Those that went for the operation was never told. When you was a struggle to prison at Tama Alande, I can't end that mobile. But I was informed equally that there was a struggle between themselves and the prisoner so that he would not destroy the phone. Okay. And uh, do you believe that on this particular occasion it was justified to beat the prisoners? No, to, 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 to make them confess? prisoner A prisoner has a right to defend. But a prisoner can very aggressive to an officer and feel far different. But where the prisoner becomes aggressive, the officer would always defend. Uh, we understand that is the right of self-defense. We are not talking about that. No, what we are saying is, according to your understanding, on this particular occasion, it was justified under the act to beat the prisoners. Yes. Uh, let me let me ask the question again and listen carefully on this particular occasion it was justified under the act to beat the prisoners is that your position yes uh, uh, like that. Yes, where he insists. I insist that one of Solam. Where he insists to give us what we need. For for he will be given twelve slas. Of course, he will be given twelve slas. And uh, you accepted that that these guys should be beaten twelve slashes. Yeah, our family member, no, we saw some medical. Oh, if I could take her, we can go and do it together. 
What officer can do command you the the act? But the officers there knows the act. There was no need for me to tell me for me to tell them as to what they would do. Uh, I agree. Nani Sonson? Uh, but there was this expectation that based on your understanding of the act that these guys would be given 12 slashes 12 slashes yes and this understanding was held by you and all the other officers. What the law permits. What the law permits was what they acted on. And uh, clearly the law permitted beating them. 12 lashes each. And yes. And that is what was done. Yes. And you were aware of it. Even if I knew, they also know about it. Uh, thank you very much. Finally, you have accepted that these people were beaten right behind your office and you were aware of it but i have never denied that i said it uh, so you accept that your prisoners were beaten right behind your office by officers designated by yourself. But you I have said it here. Thank you very much, David Coley. You spent a lot of time denying torture. Of prison inmates. Thank you for finally accepting that your prisoners were tortured behind your office. And uh, let us now look up, examine the rules for these beatings. Um, are you aware that all these prisoners were grouped together in one location? headquarters. in group when they came to the headquarters, they came in groups. And do you know that that is unlawful Mante. under your act? No, 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 they were all gathered in one place and beaten there, right behind your office. What I have said that here. Good. And I am telling you it is unlawful. Under this law, prison act to beat one prisoner. To the hearing of another prisoner. You did not know that, did you? I have offended the law that they broke was the same for all of them. So why should you hide in bringing one after the other? Uh, yes, but clearly you do not understand. 
ana bari seto so mati ko aw fahamut li wayo lu man man rek menu the prison law man lu wayo ti prison says that you should not beat a prisoner man rek mi na ni waram to tek a prisoner you should not carry out corporal punishment to the hearing of other prisoners waram to tek tek e ri ya ya ri mi man te ka pa la prisoner a jam man ko e tek ko jonde and that is rule 77 sub rule 2 of the of the prison rules there is in the prison act yolo rule 77 sub sub rule 2 sub rule 2 you did not know that did you ana man to man dit ya ni man ji mo i know could you say again ya ni man ji mo i know it uh, but your prisoners were beaten in presence of one another ani ban nan ko lakam yetteke ko prisina ko ban apri ben ko tegja amu 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 to man lakke man ko jeyi ko ko jeyi in group ko 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 man bo 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 ko nagi eno mate o ko 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 nagi mate in group ko nagi ma ma korto mo they were brought in group by the officers so they were the officers that know whether they were beaten one after the other or they were beaten as a group they are the officers that know and not me but uh, they were this was happening right behind your office right in behind not front front yes when you see the people round you were hearing them i do not deny hearing them i have said that here several times Okay so let's move on to another point. Na no continue about it. Your prisoners were beaten each of them was beaten several times. Na ne ko prisoners ko tek nya ko na ko ko batik ro nya wud ni nya no. Ye ye e matu de. I was in there bon ye nya 12 slashes wono ko semi. But I know they should have given them 12 slashes. Ya ko je nya. So if they go above 12. Don't tell me. They would not David you said they must confess nani david none in foku sanken e ko confess ya e foku e ko jeni ya tof isla ko confess yes because if they are given the 12 lasses they will confess oh my god oh my god so the whole objective of the beating is for them to confess isn't it ya hama yo ni yote take tu an ji take nya mo pour me ko sankende mo re nya that is what i have done i have accepted that uh, thank you very much mr koli for accepting uh, that uh, your prisoners were tortured na ni to baraka mr david no som nya mo tek ko prisoner ki ya ko ba tekeri i will not waste any more time on this issue of torture na 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 eta pienta do e kasanga na kati eta ke mante ko te ko te na eta pienta and uh, now i'll just move on to say that uh, i'll just leave the issue of torture completely na na ko yet kasanga na kati eta ke eteke ko adika eteke nya pana kate yo pana ane yo babu nya mo bana yo mo jabe eteke fere but are you aware that you are responsible for that torture nani, as director general of prisons nani bare man te mo man ma te ko ku ye tu lan ko kam nya mo eteke tu anu na mo kan ma te ko aw kane nu nga ro ko ma te ko ku yu aw aw kane di aw di are you aware bon inje ni no ni ta ko bon inje ni commanding officer because i was the commanding officer no he say inje ta ko bu no rega sen kan ma ja he said inje ta ko because i was commanding officer that's exactly what he said isn't it inje ta ko means i agree mm. is in that what he said mo no rega men mo rega nya ni nam di commanding officer this is what i'm saying that i am the commanding officer what i was trying to say is that was not what was interpreted okay, he said okay. ndey da kor because i was commanding so you take responsibility for that torture no no ko ko aw ko yebaj ni to aw mo ngar wo ko ko di aw bajje yes 
Good. Thank yes. you. Thank you, David. Uh, today is a new David Kelly. Yes, uh, that's very good. Now, uh, let us move on and uh, deal with uh, your prison officers. Yeah. The torture was not even limited to the prisoners. You extended it to your prison officers. Nani, etake. Nya uja abed enda ku prison officer kuali. Nani, etake fangere wa tuto buko wakano mani mimi kumako kuhiri di marayo lide. Nani, bora hiri eji jwa mantebe hani wukakaroke midi. Kuroka kia prison officers. Tu etake hiri na egore egore. Kuruwa ena kusa kumbo. What do you say? Are you saying to beat my officers? Yes. No. But you would imprison them. Ban nukula yuko. Unlawfully. Ban luwezi ni tisema ya mukuli bara ya sofi luko. Yes, luaeto. Yes, but there is a law. And tell us about the law. Niwale kwa luwezi ni tisema ya mbusu sof kuraka kuli uku. Officer, officer ni jad. Where an officer offended. To the detriment of the amicis of the prison. To the detriment of the administrations of the prisons. We, 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 if you if you are called upon for a, a, a questioning, if you deny we'll it, you. we'll keep you. Yes, but tell us the process. Like I have said, where an officer has been accused, and he is called upon for questioning, if he refused to answer, for the investigation, we detail such an officer for further investigation. And where would that be? Do it a, 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 a prison. It would be in the prison. And uh, someone like Anabi. Come an an come in Anabi. Anabi Jamme. Anabi Jamme. Yes. Abdul Jamme. Abdul Jamme. Are you aware of his detention? Of course. Boko tu mama ni matiku kusofisi of kunen. Where was where was he detained? Bobo kus kusofisi of kukun. Eh 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 mile two. Where in mile two? Mile two. Mile two confinement. Where I was before. Same place where I was before. That is so you the confinement. He, you have to make him taste what you tested. No, that, that is the only area you could keep them. Uh, and that is the security wing. Yes. And uh, which law gave you the authority to do that? It's in the act. Like I said, it is in the act. Yes, can you tell us where, which section in the act gives you power the act, the act, the to detain a prison officer at the prison officer at the security wing, at the confinement wing? confinement wing. Now, section 27 mm -hmm. of the Prison Act. Mm -hmm. The powers of the the power of arrest and remand the officer. Are you following that? Yes, I am. Any prison officer mm -hmm. may arrest mm -hmm. without uh, warrant. Why don't you Look at section 28. Yeah. 28. But let's start with 27. Uh, I am telling you, 28 is the right section. Just and now, 28. 
any prison officer accused under act may be confined in any prison quarters. Okay, in any prison quarters, Nani. that's what? Prison quarters. Nani. And prison quarters would be where the officers live, correct? And the prison quarters, where yes. the officer could kill me. Okay, continue. But, uh, Continue. Ah, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, for uh, prison, or for prison, or guard, guard room, guard room. Uh, that is that is where the police would usually sit, or prison officers would normally sit. Okay. Continue. Continue. Purpose or any prison quarters set apart mm -hmm. for the detention of the detention of um, uh, prisoner waiting trial. Awaiting trial. Yes. So that would be remand, and isn't it? The remand. One family can be that. Uh, no. And that one family is part family. of the, the, the prison uh, uh, premises. Yes, but the law. No, just, let me say. just hear me out the, me. the law does not say that such a plan officer can be detained anywhere in the prisons it gives you a list of three options it says remand Follow on the remand. Guard room. In line, it's not in the guard room. Or the staff quarters. Or the staff quarters. Those are the three. Si fi jiro sou sou sou. Yes. It does not say that you put them in confinement. Bale, lo e sen tre, man mou te bobe confinement. You agree with that? I agree, agree on that. Okay, so by, just hear me out. You agree that the act does not say you put them in confinement? Na ni nya, nou son somati kou mouwe no kou nya mou. Em, ere koutou mambou mara prisno. And the officer will be the uh, it's to my discretion because imagine uh, 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 the officer would have that the palacom is going to be convenient but could temper investigation where to keep the officer would be to my discretion if uh, i know can, can you show me yes please proceed, proceed if i know please. that keeping him at one place or like the man he would tamper with the investigations I will use my discussion to keep him at a place where he will not tamper with the investigations. Uh, one man cell in could you, could you Fuck in a one man cell at the company. Could you show me in this act uh, where it says that you have a discretion to put them in confinement? Confinement. <laughs> Discretion in Munise. Nani nya wiso. Like I said. Like I said. At the end I did law. But in the discretion in Munise. Like I said. That is not in the law. But I used my discretion. Uh, but you cannot take power that is not given to you by the law. Do you know that? 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 But you know that? I can uh, 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 use my discretion. I know I can use my discretion. You want again? What do you, what do you understand that phrase to mean? I can use my discretion. What do you understand it to mean? Fellow, I can use. One again, then if we discretion, me is separate. One man cell. No, no fellow, come on, you are middle. Like I said, I kept him in a one-man cell. That is using my discretion so that he will not tamper with the investigations. Uh, but do you aware, are you aware that you are not given that discretion by the law? Anybody? The only discretion the law gives gave you is to choose one out of the three options. It did not give you the power to choose a fourth option, an option that is different from those listed in the act. But I will not see failure to do that. But I will not see failure to do that. But I will not see failure to do that. But I will not see failure to do that. Eh, more again, you need to go to the facility. Facility is a budget. 
I am accepting that. But there were no facilities. Uh, uh, we, can, we can keep him and he will not tamper with the investigations. Uh, but I am sorry, what you did is abuse of authority. You acted unlawfully. Anyway, even if I had gone against the law, I have already informed my authorities that we don't have a place to keep him and therefore we will keep him at such a place. No, David, you wanted to punish him. That is why you put him in the most horrible place in mile two prisons. No, but uh, I mean, uh, 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 no, I did that because there must be an investigation. That is why I kept him there. Then you first send report back to the ministry and uh, uh, NIA. And I must give the report back to the ministry and the NIA. But David, this was not an investigation. This was a torture session for confessions. You have agreed to that? Well, I did not beat him and you are saying I beat... Uh, no, I did not say you beat him. I am saying that there was no investigation. It was a torture session to extract confessions because according to you they must confess nano e kanu e kanu worie pour man ou lite non pour man bangol na rek wan wana man be jame wana man be rek ni ne man be a ci la rek to bo a no rek mo ne batteke mo ka ni ni reply back men ne ina ko to e nya ngeli mo re nene nane ay ah wala ko ma jam i i know council did not say i beat but it was the interpreter that said I beat. That is why I said I did not beat. Okay. All right. We've had Martin. Everybody beat. <laughs> All right. Thank you. But focus on the commissioners when you answer questions. And, uh, I would leave this issue. Uh, the commission will decide whether you had authority to do what you did. Uh, I'll now move on uh, to the next point. Uh, do you know a person called Ibukan? He used to run a gas station. Near GPM. GPM. Station A. Gas station. Gas station. Gas station. Yes. I know him. And uh, you used to go to him to take fuel? He is a friend. Yes. He is a friend. And uh, you used to go there to collect fuel? Whenever I request for him to have help with fuel, he would always do so. And uh, he was bribing you with fuel so that you can treat Musa Suso well while in prison. Nani, oh, ala kula kesi ni esanse ipro, mamba akande au ni pro au pro mambo unu ukan Musa Suso jack di prison dang dalam memang koko le. Yo, usang kenfo. We never discussed that. Maragam, nani, insola ya fuel injo marambe nam. What he told me was, whenever I need fuel, I should go for him to help. How did you know him? Anya abu no manjo. Naja la joro. He came to the prisons and requested to see Musa. And uh, who introduced you to him? 
when he came after meeting Musa he then came and met me in my office then he introduced to me himself as somebody that works at a petrol station whenever you need assistance with regards to fuel you should always consult me I will help uh, did you sit with him and Musa in your office someone that comes to visit a prisoner bringing the prisoner to my office will my office serve as the visiting room uh, answer the question no, no it has not happened but the allegation you see you denied this allegation in court that uh, you are not given any fuel by Ibukan. Did you? Ibukan. I was not present because the court in Bundung have never been there. I did not say talk about the court in Bundung. Like I'm saying, the court, the hearings were held at Bundu. Uh, what do you say to this suggestion uh, that you are being bribed by this fuel for, uh, by giving to you by Ibu Khan so that you will help his friend Musa Suso in the prison? how would this one help how would i help uh, musa is it that i supposed to release him to go home or what uh, David, lots of accusations have emerged that you were receiving bribes in order to help uh, the certain inmates in the prison. That was normal in the prison. And normal in many prisons for that matter. Helping a prisoner. Even if you would do every other thing. Or All he wants is his liberty to go home. No, 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 no. no. David, David, prisoners would want uh, a little bit of comfort in the prisons. Wouldn't they? They would. A prisoner pop on a man, what he did care for moon or manau ayo ayolo, dear prisoner, cantum. O Kayo and Nibu, on the cell and Nicopalo, in a Kayo cannibal. He is in the cells with his colleagues, so what kind of um, comfort. comfort would he need? Extra visits? Com Bokanakum, the Kujoku, Bilkuna, who could you 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 Yes, I used to do that. Okay, and when families come and bribe you, you allow visits. But I can't do family only be the Bribes as in what? Extra fuel for your car? Generator? Generator. Yes. Sorry? I am asking, who do you say gave me a generator? And TVs? Please answer force. You said who gave me the generator? David, remember, I asked the questions. 
ajabe fo mune ngoni ma nani to na fuel extra extra you are busy taking bribes left right and center in order to give favors to certain prisoners and that is the truth I am a human being. And My work. Prisoners. Prisoners. My officers. My officers. In the other way, in English language. The other way, in the English language. Lead prisoners with humanity. Uh, it's a phrase that goes to say, lead prisoners with humanity. And lead them law abiding. And lead them law abiding. And, uh, and prison officers would take bribes to make them feel more comfortable and more law abiding. Correct? That was the culture at mile two prison. You can be chosen in mile two prison. Because you will be, be charging officers. Sorry? For that? Yes. You be yes, charging officers for because that. Because we have been charging officers for that. Uh, but you cannot charge yourself, can you? But I don't want to charge for my fault, you could. I'm the head. I'm the, I have the discretion to do it. Yes. To support. Yes. I am the head. I have the discretion to support. And and when you receive when you receive support from a family member to do something that is normal, isn't it? Yeah, I would from the family get the more and family you can support on Nibu. And comes but they support the family. The family support Nibu. What type of support? Uh, are you for instance, I bring four TVs to the prison, and Come. three would go to the prison officers, and one would go to the office of the director of prison. Was that normal? prison office, but It's lawful to me means. <laughs> One day can is just for, for, for prisoners to be comfortable. That the was prisons. that was lawful to me because what I was doing was for prisoners to feel comfortable in the prisons and also for prison officers to feel comfortable. Because prison officers for feel kula ko bukuru kula ko kuen kula ko jack modi. Yes, that is it. And uh, for the yeah, for both of them. Yeah. I was there for both of them <coughs> and. In helping the prison officers to feel comfortable, the director general must also feel comfortable. Yeah, karama na kadi ko prison officers kuali, mukmo na ko badwa nyam mesumi mi, au pop mi badwa mi wosumi mi au. Inya, I am I am prison officer pop. I am also a prison officer. So when four televisions come, one would go to the director general, and three would go to the inside prisons. Ah, kono la jasi telas. Si fi yeso ba joba bu prison officers ya kuni na joba bu au director general. Nya items should be yard where we receive items. We collocate all cells. We locate them or allocate them to all cells. Cells are not something spacious. The cells that are spacious. Who can do? Then those things will be placed. Number ya jalam. The number that we receive, we distribute it. We understand. We understand. Mm -hmm. but, and you also receive from Ibrahim Ajob. Ibrahim Ajob. Pop. 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 And because one, government did not spend oh, any dime on that. That's so. And one went into your office. Now, you can I am a dated officer only. Yes, in my office. Yes, I said it. Do you recall first day you testified here? You told us no. It was your friend 
Who bought televisions? Not, uh, I, I, I know. Yes, I, 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 I did. Wait. He's the first person. Oh, okay. 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 He's the first person. So now you accept that Baba Job's family bought TVs that they brought to the prisons, yes. and you were given one of them. Mm -hmm. yes. no. You just accepted that. You just no, that I, I don't have any, 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 any TV in, in, in my house. But you have in your office. Office is, is, is government uh, premises, not my uh, building. Did government supply you with a TV? No, I said it here. And the TV is for your comfort, isn't it? Of course, often why not? So you have to get it from the family member of a prisoner? If they restore. That is a bribe. That's not a bribe. Because everything is a, 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 a place in my tool. Not a bribe, you can take it out home. Oh. Or not a, a, a building, a, a government a premises. It's for the comfort of prison. I said it here that why we, I did that just to control the movement of prisoners in, and, the, in the yard. And the generator? We generator. I <laughs> made it very clear here. <laughs> generator, uh, uh, NID employee, uh, female wing. Sorry, juvenile wing. A four, a, a four KV. I made it very clear here. The generator was from the juvenile wing. It is a magma. I borrowed it from that. Because I had some strangers back home, because that time I did not have electricity at my house. I was in the process. Then I was in the process so that I will be supplied with electricity. So I took the generator to my home and we used it. That very day it got spoiled. I took it to the mechanician. And you continued to have no electricity. Then Namek had already given or brought my electricity. David. Please. And respect David. the commission. Okay. You ask your area when did the electricity come there? We will ask Nawek. We will ask Nawek yes. to give us the precise date when your area got electricity. Yes. Don't lie. Okay. What I'm saying is no, is the truth. I am not lying. What you people allege here is that Baba Job bought the generator. Baba Job's family bought the generator for me, and that is not true. Baba Job's wife is lying. Of course. But if you can, okay, just hear me out, answer one by one. Okay, haramaji halulu. Okay, alright, just help go. Haramaji halulu. Come on, Jad. Or come on, Jad. We have a new song. Maku juk jineto. Yangeri placeum. If you wish, you could go to Joshua Prisons and see for yourself the generator that I replaced. We are not talking about the generator from Joshua Prisons. Can any Arale waka sanken generator me ikuwe generator me yetu. No matter the generator, Joshua is full. Like I said, the generator was from just one. That's the okay. generator I borrowed. Okay, all right. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. So Baba Job's wife lied about giving you a generator. Correct? That's yeah. what you said. Of course. But she did not lie about Baba Job's brother giving you the television. Correct? is for the prisons department uh, well, my arguments are if you indicate that Baba Joe's brother gave me the TVs they were for the comfort in the prisons uh, and, and also the comfort of the director general I will not and just like the fuel just like the fuel was for the comfort of the director general the movement of the prisons yes it's, it's my comfort because we, 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 we sometimes obedience and I we are your emergency for the auxiliary in law. Sometimes we would need in law. You are accepting a bribe. They gave you these privileges. 
so that you can treat the people better in the presence. That is precisely the reason. Ah, you can can't Tonya. We manage when. What I know is that. When I have a constraint and they come in to support. It's normal. That is normal. Exactly. For, for, for the function of the government of the day. Because it was for the function of the government of the day. Uh, who is to give you money for the running of the prison? I want to master the passage in the prison. Government. Uh, so Ministry. You, should you be accepting gifts from uh, uh, family members of inmates? Yeah, I where somebody offered for me to be able to run the administration for I would accept. Okay, thank you very much. Mr. Chair, perhaps this is a convenient time to stop for the first break and then uh, we will return for another session. Okay. We will come back at um, uh, 12 noon meetings adjourned. Supersonics Money Transfer is giving you an unbeatable offer this Tabaski. Your family and friends can now send you monies from the whole of Europe, US, Canada, and Switzerland for absolutely free. Yay! Yes! This Tabaski, enjoy our safe, fast, reliable, and convenient money transfer service with the largest payout network in the Gambia at zero transfer charges. So your family and friends wouldn't have to worry about transfer charges when sending you monies from Europe, USA, Canada, and Switzerland. This Tabaski. Visit the Google Play Store or the Apple Store today to download the Supersonics Money Transfer app and enjoy excellent money transfer services only with Supersonics. Support your own. Tabaski just got better with Supersonics Money Transfer. Supersonics Money Transfer, Nyolen Indil, Hey World Burere, Jabale Kochi Tabaski Bi Nyoy Digmal, Legi Seimbok, Aksa Ay Amdi Jam, Mwenen Layon Ne Khalis, Bayeko, Fofucha Europe, US, Canada, Wala Switzerland, Tegun Chifay Dara, Wow, Wow, Klika Warol Moy, Mbota Yon Ne Kay Khalis, Bigena Maga Chi Gambia, Nyolen Ko Indil, Gauna, Warna, Napalena, Te Amul Ben, Jafe Jafe, Bichinek, Kona, Yen Bokwe, Ak Amdi Jamme, Jaratut, Nyan de Halat, Chibolin Dione Halis, Fichibi Rewi Gambia, Bayeko, Fofucha Europe, US, Canada, Wala Switzerland, Chitubeski B, Nye Digman, Satan and Yu, Chigugu Play Store, Wala Apple Store, Nyan Mana Am, Sun Abbi, the Supersonic Money Transfer App, Nahyan Mana Hewalu, Chihewal B, Nyulen Indil. Dollar la linga mom, supersonics, sumo tabaskiran, nechna.